Welcome to tutorial number two, transcribing weather information. First go to ForeFlight, open scratch pads, open a new scratch pad, select type. The standard iOS keyboard will pop up at the bottom. Touch the globe symbol in the bottom left and that will open FF keyboard. Now you're ready to begin entering data. Start by entering the name of the current ATIS. Let's say, for example, it's Juliet. This will place the word ATIS, a colon, and the word Juliet and move to the next line so you're ready to begin transcribing weather information. You can either touch the weather tab in the bottom corner or simply swipe upward and that allows you to have access to the weather information. If you choose, you can enter the Zulu time, let's say 1813 Zulu. Then enter your weather. Say the wind is 270 at 09, gusting to 23 knots. Sky is clear. There are scattered clouds of 5,500, broken at 6,500, and overcast at 9,000. Temperature, 23, dew point, 18. You'll notice that the spaces are automatically placed. And when you move on to altimeter setting, a space will be placed in the letter A. So let's say it's 29 or 9 or 7. And then other information such as visual approach, landing and departing, runway 7, in use. You can finish by adding Notums, if you like, and if you want to type the entire notums in, you could go back to the iOS keyboard and use the QWERTY keyboard. And you can finish your weather report by putting in the ground frequency or the clearance delivery frequency. The next video tutorial will cover clearance delivery.